All right, all right. What's going on, guys? We are back with the Welling United lower league management save. And yeah, we've started pretty well. We've only been getting, yeah, well, hey, the same letter as well. Wins. <laughs> yeah, we've just been getting wins. Things are uh, things are looking really good at the moment. I'm really enjoying playing uh, playing the save. We're not going to waste many time or much time, though. We're just going to get straight into... All right, we're going to attacking corner. Concord Rangers, where are they where are they situated? They're seventh, and meter prediction twelve. So uh, away from home, I reckon it's going to be one for us to work on our defensive shape. Yeah, I like how there's not as much training. I did touch on like game to game, the continuation is not as long. Maybe that's why less transfers or no <laughs> transfers training to simulate, less training sessions to sim. Let's let's go. How are we all, Dong? Where is? <laughs> yeah, now we're all just set up. Uh, Poke Joe, hey, what's going on? Yeah, we're just setting up the stream now to have hopefully another run. Hopefully another run. Continue the wins, hey. Continue the Ws is what we love to do. go but how are we all how are we all traveling hope you guys are well spursy boy what's up what's up what's up finally here on time fmtv i've got a date tonight oh he's in he's in that's not a life i can live at the moment Lockdown life in Australia, in Melbourne specifically, the rest of the country is not. So, yeah. Most Liverpool's, li most livable city, yeah. I think we were crowned that a couple of years ago. <laughs> Definitely not this year. Definitely not this year. Not going to get that crown this year. <laughs> I don't think anywhere could, to be honest. My, you know, my plans is continuing to dominate with Welling. With Welling in the, yeah, National League South. Getting Ws. Hopefully we do so anyway. Ooh, but when Bar City comes up, that's going to be an interesting encounter. That's going to be an interesting one. Oh, uh, yeah, don't forget, guys. Don't forget we brought in Peter Crouch as an under-18s manager. Like, like under-18s manager, Peter Crouch. Just, it's just mad to see, to be honest. Whereas my life is about to get my... Your name... Dong Shlong Wet, man. Like, <laughs> what can I say to that? What can I say to that? We got Concord Rangers. Concord Rangers. Yeah, we did mention they're they're a tricky they're a tricky encounter. Media prediction twelfth. But they're sitting in seventh. Uh, we're away for this one. We're away here, so Oh wait, when was that next game? Yeah, okay. Seven days, Wildston. Week break. Let's continue. Matt, see, look at all mm. Julian and now. Julian probably needs some playing time. Under 23s. You got McCallum there. Berry. Feeling old to have Big Pete as a manager. <laughs> just a bit. Just a bit. So, yeah, we've got a striker on the bench. Midfielder, attacking midfielder. Could play on, on the right side as well. And we got Diamonds, who is a. I like to say he's a DM at his best, but can play center mid, center back, and right back. Then Critchlow Noble can put in left back. And Thacker, yeah, more center back or midfield, center mid or DM. So I like that mixture, not going to lie. 
Not gonna lie, we are we're, we're we're choosing to go without a keeper. I haven't gotten like a keeper injured for years now, so for the longest time. So let's keep it up. Our leading goal scorer, Rob Swain, at the back with that six, he's absolutely deadly. So let's not waste any more time. Even though that Johnson looked all right, he scored two goals in one game. So I think he comes in when we need to when we need to rotate more. This game, I feel like. Coombe starts when he gets a bit tired Goldberg comes on so yeah I feel we do have the coverage there so let's just get straight into it let's get straight into it and hopefully hopefully we get another win <laughs> I'm saying like hopefully I think because it's my first game of the stream uh yeah when we've been playing some good football it's still oh, away from home against a team that's got some all right results so yeah carry straight on from the last match we're saying that at every, like, every next match at this point. There we go. I have faith in you. We're ready. We're ready, guys. What's your predictions? You reckon we can get another W? Are you fancying us here? Oh, did Carlton win? No, they lost their game. Don't want to talk about it. Just don't talk about it. Don't talk about it. Six goals in five games for a centre-back. And he got a hat-trick as well. Don't forget the hat-trick performance. That was special. All right. It's a bit of a quiet game. I anticipated this a little bit. Uh, we've been excellent, though. If you look at the match stats, I feel like a goal is coming for us. Vos Dom. Oh, Dom. Come on, man. You got to get that. Yeah, look at the match stats. Like, surely if we keep playing the way we are, uh, we have to. We're, we're going to go attacking. Yeah, direct, much higher, even be more expressive. We just look better than them. We look better than t uh, too good, so we should go a bit more on the attack. Even if it's away from home, surely. Nah. <laughs> What a terrible strike. They got, you know, they got their fair amount of fans there. Oh, here we go. I like, I don't know, guy. Is it this pitch? Like, I know, I feel there's like a different angle of the camera and I haven't changed it. It's just the standard, like, director. Dong Vos. Dong Vos. Oh, gosh. Dong, Dongy Vos. So, the problem is right now, I'm, I'm going to say I'm not happy with the performance, but we've been in control, we just haven't got the goal, so it's it's an interesting one. He still lost confidence, Nathan Green, so that's not a good thing. Like, seriously, 12 shots in total. Concord showing great social distancing. Oh, but now here he is, Vose. He's, he's controlling the mid. Coombs. That was hard for them to defend, really. Incredibly tough. Swain, he's a beast. We talk about his goals, but don't forget his defending ability has been right up there as well. So there's Green. Oh, he does go long to Cook. What can he create? Not too much, but it keeps coming back to us, which is a good thing. Rooney. Uh, coins, hey, what's going on? What's going on? God, you put your flag up, you can't. Yeah, sure you did. <laughs> but I, I was anticipating that to be offside, and I still got mad. Like, yeah. I just feel like it could end up playing out this way, and we don't get a breakthrough, and I'm going to be annoyed. But it, sure, it surely has to come. Surely. Oh, gosh. Offside, yeah, man. Let's see, what else have we got? Woods, he's good. Shit, can't line up. That's it. Now, Swain. Oh, come on. If we somehow don't get a goal, this is going to be... This is going to be something. Come on. Oh, it's going to fall! No, you got to score from here, Coombs. Uh, guys... That's how this game was for us. That we would have to score in that position. 
to make sure of the goal. That's how we had to do it. It's in, fine. Like, look, this is how we had to score. Goes past, couldn't finish, and that's how, yeah. It, it, we take it. I take it, not going to complain at all. You won't see me complaining when we find the back of the net, but it's just the fact that we've controlled this game magnificently. So something we're going to do now, we're going to play a positive game. We're going to stay in control, but like shorter passing, but still that higher tempo and walk ball into the box, but more discipline now. So we're going to roll, roll in with those changes. Atrocious keeping. Okay, we just have to wait till this goes through. Yeah. That's what you get in the lower leagues, though. Oh, look, Henry. Oh, <laughs> like we were going in the last stream, calling... Oh, not him, actually. It was, it was someone in midfield. Their first name was Henry. Henry Woods, yeah? Henri Woods. Henri. But the actual striker whose last name is Henry, with, with because he didn't get a goal. <laughs> uh, oh, it's Elliot. He, he had no chance. He had no chance of converting with a strike like that. Yeah, Ro Rooney's... See, this is the interesting fact. Oh, we got Cookie. Cookie. Let's put Cook over on the side where Rooney is. Rooney's off. And we're going to put Nathan Green. Like, look at the the depth to my changes at this point. <laughs> it's it's kind of mad. But hey, they work. See, he's best as a defensive winger. We we have got a lead. Defensive winger support is not too bad. He will still get an early cross in. Yeah, he'll still get some crosses. Coombs, he got his goal. Oh, that's a tough one. Henry, ooh, what would you do in this situation, guys? When your striker who scored, but he's got five less condition, his overall look, risk of injury is high. They're both risk. Would you take Henry off? Yeah, would you take Henry or Coombs at this point? What do you guys do in this situation? Let us know. But we'll take off the other Henry, Woods, and bring on Connor Diamond. Just be, yeah, that bit more stronger. He can be a defend role on that. What is Rooney's aggression? Yeah, he did get a sending off. Rooney. It's only three, though. It's only three. It's because we are getting stuck in. Where are we? Yeah, get stuck in. So we've we took off both players on yellows. I want to wait though. Uh, I might wait. What five five or so minutes, and then make another sub. Coombs, don't forget the next game is in a week. So we got to balance. Wait, was Coombs injury prone? Was he the one injury prone? Might have problems with injuries. All right, that confirms it. Swain, yeah, he should be able to recover for the next game. So Coombs off. That almost confirms. That change, yeah. Uh, and then Goldberg, he's best... Guys, he doesn't have a natural... He, he's he got accomplished roles, but yeah. Not a full natural role as a striker. Now, Johnson. A second goal will be perfect. Well, here's Goldberg. Here's Goldberg. Oh, almost. <laughs> Bar City taking a lead as well. Uh, where did I download the logos? Ooh, do I have a do I have a command for the logo pack? I know I do have have one for the face pack. Have to wait. Hold up. See what we do in this game. But I get them from sortedoutsi.net. It's the same one as the face pack. So I know the face pack one will work for sure. So that I know that is a link for the face pack. But yeah, if you go to the, uh, it's the metallic logos. The metallic logos we use. Sorted out at SI. So, yeah, if you just go into the graphics section of that, navigate to the graphics section, it, yeah, it has everything. Uh, has everything. Lockers, hey, what's going on? What is going on? Hope you're well, mate. Hope you're well, as we're getting another victory. No worries, no worries. We got a lot of graphics. <laughs> we got a lot of graphics. So there we go. Things are looking good. Things are looking good. For us.
Let's keep it going. So we'll stand in seven days. Oh, we've got a test, guys. We've got a test. Their meter prediction fourth, and they're sitting in third. So this is this is a a bit of a challenge for us. It's at home though, so we're gonna have our attacking movement. Let's get ready for that. Let's get ready. Big game. See, this is a week, and look how quick we'll progress through it. I might take a look at. Oh yeah, I was taking a look at this guy. Maybe yeah, we were keeping in mind maybe a left midfielder if we needed on loan. The Wildston Raider is traveling to Welling. I really do not know that meaning. <laughs> uh, but anyway, they're they're here. What's, oh yeah, what I was going to say is, our finances, not looking good. We're already in the red in August, so you're hoping we go a cup run. However, however far away that is. FA Cup, second qualifying round. Yeah, still a bit of a journey. Still a bit of a journey. What's that? Yeah, we have got a few at left mid. Like, you saw what I did in that last game. We can push green up to left midfield as well. We can use green there. And we've got Julian. Julian can play left mid. And then McCallum as well. So, yeah. But the problem is, what I mean is the quality of these. The quality of these. But yeah, oh, I'm going to get a link. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to get a link. Uh, Curtis, hey, what's going on? You just missed another win. We snuck a 1-0. We've only got wins. If you want to update, it's six games, six wins, six goals for our center back. <laughs> oh, Brett, Ri who's this guy, Brett Williams? Like, okay, he looks, yeah, pretty solid. Solid player. But yeah, Rob Swain. Rob Swain are beastly, str very strong. Very strong. Centre back. Our leader at the back, and he scored a few goals as well. But yeah, if you just join in, we've got a big game coming up. we got a big game coming up against the team in third. Yeah, it's just mad to see. The centre back with three goals. Ooh, Foley. Oh no, yeah. Kevin Foley. Yeah, I was gonna say a DMing the link is absolutely perfect. Then I'll check it out later. A post for it, yeah, in the chat and then I I I'll say, Oh yeah, I'll check that out. And then I forget it. I mean, it <laughs> I'll have to save it. Anyway. Beast in the air, Swain. He is. And defensively, very, very good. <laughs> the most important thing for him. But yeah, the goals are a bonus. I guess it's just what we're focusing on. See, McCallum. Yeah, I don't I don't see a future for Gavin Mc... Oh, uh, I'm just going to leave you alone, to be honest. Does anyone do that? You just... Uh, who cares? <laughs> then just go on to the next player and praise him. There you go, Johnson. Ooh, some nice progression from Johnson. Do you have a training? That's mad. Like, guys, do you ever notice your player, you, you just got the playing position set and you don't have any other extra training and he trains well. Do you sometimes just leave it? I'm going to leave it. <laughs> He's training well like that. I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, they train the best like that, to be honest. Yeah. When you think, okay, let's master our training. Get all your players on the best roles and everything. And then you do that and they get <laughs> they train well. Uh, next, QPR manager. Good afternoon. How are you doing? How are you doing? All right. So, McCallum. Guys, what... Now you call him up, he's, he's, what is he going to provide you? I'm, as I'm saying this, he's got three assists in two games, but I'm well, I'm well, thank you. 
And we're getting some good results here. Let's see that's what I mean. Next match, Wilston, let's go. Playing position and automatic intensity, and for some reason they grow. Hey. <laughs> what whatever works, yeah. Oh yeah, Harold's Harold's gonna need some game time as well. I do like our squad size. I mean, there's a uh, Johnson we promoted from the under 23s as a striker. Milton, who's a youth player, only 17. So we yeah we promoted him from the youths. We got a good mix. Got a good mix of players. Not even worrying about goalkeeper. <laughs> yeah, goalkeeper on the bench. I didn't get time to watch your YouTube before this. That's all right. <laughs> He's an overweight maple syrup drinking winger, is Gavin. Damn, that's crazy. Damn. <laughs> what a what a description. Hi, mate. What happened to Barcelona? Oh, like the journeyman say. Yeah, I just wasn't feeling the journeyman save anymore, to be honest. I feel, yeah, we we played it a lot. <laughs> and I, I just feel like, yeah. Sometimes you you can't say so much more with a save and you're like, you just, I remember describing it and a few other people agreed. Like, you just feel like you've come to the end of a save and you, you're going through the motions of it a bit. You're not loving it as much how I'm finding this now with Welling back to the challenge. It's back to that challenge again. So let's, yeah, let's head into this game. Let's head into this game and chase an important victory. We've got a few teams chasing us and yeah, Wildston is, is one of those. Did you apply... No, I, I started the save with them. I started a new save with them. Rip Vito and Vinny. Yeah, they'll never be forgotten. They'll always be remembered on the stream. For that save... Oh my gosh! Wilkes! How... How did you not save that? <laughs> like, imagine that. Someone quits resigns from Barcelona and takes a job in the lower leagues in England. Like, keeper, mate. You got your hands to it. You should have saved that. Boy, oh boy. Can we get a goal back right away? Can we go? Yes, we can. Oh, what are you putting your flag up for? Is that like a sign that you want? I don't know. Like, <laughs> oh. He didn't. Oh, Jones. What? what? Just leave it. That was going to be a goal. Uh oh, we we get a we get a good opponent, and drama ensues. Oh, all right, let's go more creative. Uh what's going on? What's going on? I'll keep that. Just come on. Still early. Still early. Long throw. It's a goal. It's a goal. It's a goal. Uh, there we are. V8, gang. There we go. <laughs> Here we go. Coombs. We get it back, boys. We get that back. Do you think too much... What? Do you think too much on reputation on this FM? I know reputation's important. I don't, yeah, I don't know. What you mean? <laughs> Coombs! should have scored one on one but you know oh the rain's you know the rain's pouring down at the moment there we go interesting yeah interesting game at the moment it is I'm not happy with the performance <laughs> Oh, let's go. Let's push on into... My reaction to that is, I always say, I love when you can say that when it's a draw, especially when you just got an equalizer, because then you can push on in the second half with your players knowing they need to do more. Uh, Ari123 is the best. Hello, mate. What's going on? Uh, another notification there. The North Man. Thanks for the follow, mate. Thanks for joining the stream. So, yeah, we've got a big game, though. We got a big oh, yeah you know to get a winner here to get a winner here we gotta we gotta dig deep. 
Yeah, I'm doing pretty well. Hope you're hope you're doing well yourself, mate. But yeah, yeah, as I'm from Australia, Melbourne, Australia, it's 1.45 a.m. in the morning. So it's, you know, yeah, it's one of those situations. <laughs> uh, sleeping schedule is just kind of messed. But because of how this year is, it's it probably doesn't matter too much. <laughs> it's not impacting too much. Uh, anyway, anyway, let's, let's make a change. Who's that change going to... Goldberg has... Oh, yeah, Henry hasn't done enough. So we're going to bring Goldberg on two advance forwards. Cook. Ooh, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? We're going to... Because uh, we had the target man. Let's go over the opposition defense. We'll go with that. Because not playing with the target man now. Rooney hasn't done that great. But, you know, we don't have that many options. Let's try and switch things up. I want to go a slightly shorter, yeah, because we've got player defense, so be more disciplined, work ball into box. Let's see what this has got. Is it, they score a free kick, will it be? Oh, it's disallowed. Love that. Yep, late night stream, definitely. Yeah, man, I, yeah, I notice. yeah, I notice your name. Yeah, I got the notification. I got my phone up, so yeah, I saw that. Appreciate that very much, mate. Yeah, late night streams I've had, you know, <laughs> pretty regularly uh, in this year. But then I would go in a period of not, yeah, not doing them. And then I might do in the afternoon for me, which hits a morning stream for you guys, majority of you guys. Well, I say you, like, who else from Australia is going to be up right now <laughs> watching some FM? You never know, though. How are you finding the stream so far? Yeah, it's it's okay. Like, this save, uh, this is this save is, I mean, we've won all games. We've won all games with this, so that says a lot. That's why, yeah, I'm really going for this at the moment. Noble's going to come on for Cook, and then we're going to do a good old switch. Good old switch there. Green, we'll go winger. Yeah, yeah, we we had the media prediction of about seven, uh, was it seventh or so? And uh, yeah, along with that, the board wants us to reach the playoffs. But we're looking, yeah, we're looking good for that. We're looking good for that at the moment. And another contender, where are they? Yeah, fourth at the moment. So a draw wouldn't be horrendous, avoiding a defeat against them. So, there you go. Say, demand more. Oh, your local side. What's that? Uh, Mini Finchy. Mini Finchy. The Wings. They don't have them described as the Wings in the game. Are you disappointed as that? Like, they don't have a nickname? If we just head over to the club info? Null. <laughs> Nothing is there. I'd be disappointed. I'd be disappointed with that. We do have one more sub of our sleeves to make. Uh, but what the time here is, it's 1.48 a.m. in the morning. Almost 2 a.m. I'll see how we go. I'll see how we go. <laughs> if it's going to be an all-nighter, that's what I mean by seeing how we go. Uh, Montel. Vos has been... Oh, we're going to take off Woods. Uh, so we'll have two creators. Kind of. We're going to use him as a Mazala. Yeah. There's some, there's a few good teams. There's a few good teams around us. Well, good team. Yeah, they've started well to the season. Armani? Do you mean Arzani? <laughs> Armani. Nah, it's, yeah, Arzani. Nah, I've, I don't like how he's rated in Football Manager, to be honest. Wow, that was a poor shot. Is the sound weird for everyone or just me? Or is it just my voice? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It should be all right. So a draw. Hmm. I'm not going to complain. I'll take a draw. Still unbeaten. It just wasn't our day. 
Nathan Green switches off. Not pleased, and he's still switched off. I mean, he had a poor game. Yeah, normally on Twitch. I've experienced that, like, with sometimes when I'm watching a stream. The sound might go weird, and I just refresh. That's it. So, yeah, I have pretty decent internet myself. So, sometimes it's just Twitch playing up. And we'll do that. So, September... Yeah, ahead of Bar City, we've got, yeah, unavailable training. So, I love it. Trump is so stupid. Where did, sorry, where did Trump come from? <laughs> Coins. Uh, gosh. Like, I feel it doesn't need to be said. <laughs> it's, like, obvious. Like, what more can we put into that statement? But, yeah, sure, he is. <laughs> There's not much more we can put into that. Ooh, Montel, just positive personality traits. So a lot of time, that's a, basically the termination. Going up. We'll take that. Swain. Oh, he doesn't get the player of the much. The mu munch? Mu month. There we go. Player of the month. But, I mean, Brett Williams has got nine goals in seven. But how about a, a, a defender, a centre-back that's got six goals? Add six goals on top of his defensive performances as we sweep the manager of the month. There we go. We're still, we're top of it. Has everyone played their game? Okay, that's fair enough. Well, look, it's good. I'm I'm glad we're still top of the league after we, we didn't get a win still. That's all right. And two days later, we got Bar City. Oh, let us know if you remember when I did a Bar City save on YouTube. Good old Bath City. Throwbacks. That was a time. So, young Steve Nash. Yeah, Bath City. I, I did a few, though. <laughs> I did a few. That, it was a good time. My first. My first one, I think I did, was in FM15. Yeah, that was a good time, I'm not going to lie. This is giving me similar feelings, though. You got that Bath City in my recommended one. Yeah. What was the strike you had up top? Poof, I can't remember, man. Yeah, I did FC... Yeah, FC United. I, I did FC United at some point. You did one as well. Yeah. Nah, that's cool. Sharing the love. Sharing the love. <laughs> See, that's a... Yeah... A lot of people be like, if someone else is doing a similar save, like, oh, you copied him. But like, how many people in that own football manager are going to be playing with those teams? <laughs> so yeah, that's all good. Oh, I li I like to see someone out uh, how someone else is doing as well. You can compare notes. Uh, you can take tips. Or if you see if someone is doing something poorly, you can not do that <laughs> you can avoid doing that so yeah that's all good uh, it's, it's been a good it's been a good journey of the fm content over the years yeah man football football manager the football manager content is like that though like even the top guys views wise like if football manager was a more popular game on youtube like views would be much much higher for them like they probably deserve like the top fifa maybe like the top fifa channels like that do career mode and stuff like because they're similar type of series maybe deserve to get 40 you know 40 30 40k each episode but yeah the the audience level isn't the same so yeah so for the for everyone else, you know, views aren't gonna it's not it's not gonna be about that. It's about enjoying a good save, you know. Seeing what other people are doing. And I did that for a really long time, or in a similar way. I always would go like on the forums and stuff like that, talk about football manager. So that's why I found myself doing this kind of thing, I think, because I always love seeing other people's thoughts of football manager or how my save is going, talking about players, tactics. Yeah, it's always been something I've enjoyed. So, well, this kind of save is pretty common. Yeah, 
I always did this. I, this has always been one of my favorite saves uh, because it's one of the earliest ones I did in Football Manager when I got, just got the game. I think I, I started with it uh, like in a top division and I'm like, okay, this is a bit easy. What's the challenge? <laughs> Let's go in the lowest league. And yeah, I found a love for this style of save way back. So yeah, there's been no way back since then. <laughs> That's for sure. Yeah, it's about sharing, wanting people to see what you're doing. I love that site. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I love seeing opinions. That's why sometimes when I get a comment on YouTube, just like the good old first or second, uh, like, oh my God, these comments. <laughs> That's cool though. That's cool. I, that's why I love the stream though. That's why I love streaming because you can see here, it's like a constant chat. It's a constant chat, even with about like 20 or so viewers, which is nothing crazy. Um, but I appreciate all you guys here, of course. Uh, but yeah, it's it, I love the interaction fact. Uh, what else is that? Uh, Corey Henry? Yeah, he's been all right. I, I like his work. He, obviously, he's only got two goals. That's what I mean. He's doing more than scoring goals, which is nice. Uh, Jezza, what's up? Uh, I'm okay. Nah, we're, Melbourne, we got back into lockdown. We're six. Uh, we're back with another six weeks. We're in the second week of that, right? It's, you know, it's it's killer. Not going to lie. I, you know, a lot of people during this time are going to be like, like you try and think positive, but there's so many negatives. Like all my fam, like a lot of my family, like my mum, sister and brother live in different states now where a couple of years ago, we all lived in the same house. So we'd see them every single day. And now they just like, they're in different states and I can't go visit them. You off work? Well, yeah, I'm not really, yeah, I'm not in a job at the moment, but I, I haven't you know, YouTube is a bit on and off for me. Like what I mean by that is I have very good months from like when FIFA drops for like from, so normally September, but I believe FIFA's dropping October, early October this year, isn't it? So from September to December, I, I do pretty well. And like my first initial career mode series does well, sets me up for the year. So yeah, <laughs> this time is more a low key, a low key time of the year, but yeah, um, then we're going to get going again. Uh, with the with the content yeah fifa always goes big for me the fifa career mode so i'm thankful for that anyway let's get into a game <laughs> love seeing the the comments in the chat but yeah let's let's try and get into this one against bath city oh boy bath city what have they got for us let's go into it what are your guys predictions what are your guys predictions oh me coming up yeah, Brunt, guys, he's OP. He's OP. Oh, Dan Ball at centre back. I'm liking that. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, you know, I've had my run-ins with Dan Ball over the years with in my saves. So I'm like, I, I don't really rate him defensively. That's that's what I'm trying to say. Right here, Smith. Smith is not a bad player. He's a good because yeah, pretty young. He's only 21. They're all right, but Brunt, yeah, Brunt is a is a top man, <laughs> up top. Yeah, he's a strong striker, someone you have to watch out for. But we've been good. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, we have been good, and I guess you can say league table. Well, expect nothing but a win against the Bath. A couple two one predictions. Uh, Cook winner, Mini Finchy thinks. Let's let's see what we got. Let's see what we got in us today. Some early possession. You know, it's I was gonna say it start to even out, then it goes back to sixty percent. Hmm. All right. I was about to say. Oh, I was about to shout. Let's see. Uh, have I seen strength make a huge difference for striker? Oof. It's interesting. I generally will see like stronger strikers as target man or as a target man, they do well. But is it because of their strength or their height? Like their jumping reach? Does that tie into that? Or how much does it? Hmm. But here's Vos, Dominic Vos. He's not a bad player. Really happy that we got him as a creative midfielder. We we really did need a creative mid. It was hard to find for a bit. Oh, what a ball. 
That should have been a goal. That should have been a goal there, man. Disappointed that we couldn't find the breakthrough. That was a nice chance. So, yeah, nil-nil, still nil-nil. Adam Coombs missing sitters. Wow, this game is realistic. <laughs> oh, I love that. But he, he's looked dangerous for us. But I guess that's a fact. Like, he's got in, like, a lot of positions to score. But he hasn't scored as many goals as I would have hoped. Oh, yeah. For you guys, if you're just dropping into the into the save, Rob Swain, our centre-back, has got six goals in seven. <laughs> six goals in seven. So, yeah, he's a big boy. He's almost two metres, 196 centimetres. So I think that's like 6'4". And then weight, 112 kilograms. I know a lot of you guys from UK. I think that's like 17 stone or something excessive. <laughs> but yeah, he, he's a pretty, he's a big boy. He's a big lad, that's for sure. Unfortunately, nil-nil. Nil-nil at this point in time. What are we going to say? Let's go far from please. Green losing confidence. Like, that's never a good thing. A lot more to come from you, and he still lost confidence. If a player has lost confidence, and then as a manager, you say you got confidence in him, like, I have faith in you, like, what else can you really do? <laughs> Not too sure. I reckon, yeah, we got to go attacking. There's a highlight. Long throws OP. Oh, he has to score. It's Corey Henry. Someone mentioned him just before, and he steps up with another goal. Coombs with the assists. Love that. Love that work. Yeah, long throws OP. Yeah, but then Cook with some good work. Coombs played it to our advantage or yeah, until we had that open, open shot. Cook. Oh, great ball. Like, here's Swain. Ah, terrible. But yeah, nice 1 0 lead. Under press. Oh, he had to win that. Riley low. They go long. That's ah, good header. Long. Oh, Coombs. Nice. Nice down to Woods. We're getting a lot of space. Cook. That was a weak, that was a weak shot, man. I was expecting something a bit more convincing. But it is the lower leagues. It is the lower leagues. Uh, Rob Swain, we've got to take off. We can't get this man injured. We can't get this man injured. We've got a lead, so let's bring on Josh Stacker at the back. Uh, we'll leave that. Coombs off. Let's bring on Goldberg. Uh, his dad is actually the owner of the club. So he's the son. He's the son of the owner. <laughs> it's mad. And I had a bit of a few run-ins with the owner already. He's just he he he's not listening to too much, <laughs> too much request. Uh, we'll say that much. Uh, Henry Woods will take him off, and then Diamond in midfield. No, we're not changing our formation. That's his name. Just go more defensive. Uh, Bradley is one of the best players at the club. You know, no, he he he's actually been all right. He's been, we've we've been using him as a bit of a super sub, but he scored four goals in the preseason. Well rounded, then a bit of pace. Yeah, I can see him do well. Play my son, but don't blame him. <laughs> oh, I praised there. Take, oh my gosh, we're lucky. What's that, 5-0? Brain tree. They've had a brain explosion. How about that? Ah, still holding top of the league, boys. There we go. Yeah, Corey Henry, player of the match. To be fair, we were, honestly, well, yeah, off the player ratings, we didn't look that great. Like, no one really stood out today. But we had 15 shots. We had more chances than... Uh, opponents uh, for this one today. A very nice victory. Happy with the work. Happy with your work, guys. 
Let's keep going. Let's keep going here. Top of the league. Sitting pretty. Sitting pretty. Then we got Eastbourne next. Eastbourne. 17th. So they're not doing the greatest. Then St. Auburn City. 20th. So guys, why I know how to pronounce their name. Well, we got a St. Auburn's where I live, like in Melbourne, like it's a suburb. Um, yeah. uh, do you hear like a lot of people might like not from England might pronounce it as St. Albans. Have you heard people pronounce it like that? <laughs> St. Albans. But yeah, we got probably about 20 minute drive from my house. St. Albans. Yeah. Americans do. St. Albans. St. Albans. <laughs> but yeah. Also me assuming that it's pronounced the same for you guys. But yeah, we got... America's butcher everything. Do you ever find it weird when you're watching an American play FM and they've got like the American English on and they've got like just the, yeah, the different words. Well, oh, I forgot what they were, but you will remember some. Yeah, you will remember them. Like, don't they have salary for contract or something like that? I don't know. And for per, not per week, they have it like per annum or something. Yeah, roster. Oh, it's mad to... <laughs> it's like you're playing a different game almost. We're playing soccer manager 2020. Soccer manager. <laughs> uh, that's probably one of the rare ones I can hit well with the... Um, with the accent. <laughs> the soccer. And in, in Australia, like... For people that don't call it football, pronounce soccer with like two Ks. Soccer. Soccer. <laughs> with an A and an H. Oh, gosh. The Socceroos. I mean, we've got Socceroos in our name. In Our national team is called the Socceroos. So, what, <laughs> what can we say, man? Try English accent. For me, there's too many, and I'm not good. I'm, no, not at all. There's there's too many British accents. Like, seriously. <laughs> like, what do you guys think? Like, there's just so many. Some are pretty mad. But no, they're cool, though. So, I feel like in Australia, we don't have that much variance. There's a few, like, but nah. I feel like you guys have, like... <laughs> I don't even know how many different. Like, there could be, like... I don't know. Definitely over five to ten. And you're like, yeah, there's way more than that. Uh, Liverpool Scouse one. Yeah. <laughs> um, um, um. Like Stevie G, yeah? <laughs> um, South London... I know there's one, like, I watched this video, like, an accent video on YouTube, and, like, this guy doing different accents from, like, all different places. Like, so there's, like, different countries in that. And then, like, next minute, he's doing, like, one or two minutes on all different British accents, because there's so many of them. There's so many. Uh, but anyway, yeah, Eastbourne Borough, it's away from home. So then, yeah, we got a week break until the next game, <laughs> St. Albans. All right, couple games. So yeah, we should be all right. That's why I like to keep the tabs on. Yeah, the amount of breaks, amount of day breaks. Uh, we should be all right. Uh, Berry, we haven't really t used too much. Uh, Johnson's doing nicely. Like, yeah, his stamina eleven, but natural fitness thirteen. Game to game, he's yeah fit enough. So yeah, we're not going to change too much. I reckon we're still playing some good football. So let's let's keep that going. Yeah, why don't we just keep that going, boys? They're playing a 4-1-2-3. A 4-1-2-3. It's good balance. <laughs> yeah, someone... I think one of the mods added, like, the question mark. When someone does a question mark, Nightbot hits up a question mark. Uh, what football team do we all support? 
Guys, get your... I support myself, Manchester United for the Premier League. Uh, but Melbourne victory in the A-League in Australia. Do you guys support any teams outside of outside of your country? Obviously, it's big for Premier League, like, you know, yeah, all other countries in the world. Uh, we'll have some fans, but, yeah. Uh, Everton, Timmy Cahill, Timmy Cahill. Did you love him? Did you love him at Everton? Uh, but let's just say, yeah, the pundits have been right to back us up. Did you sign Johnson or was he already at Welling? No, he was in the he was in the reserves. John the Yeah, the young striker. Or wait, sorry, sorry guy. You you would mean the right no right back. <laughs> Cause the other guy was a striker, yeah. Yeah, we had a, a jo Archie Johnson. Archie Johnson. Sorry. Yeah, you meant you meant Chiori? Kiori, I don't, I don't know that name. Uh, oh, he was actually at Arsenal. So some of you guys may have heard of him before. So there you go. Uh, but no, he's yeah, he's been here. Yeah, you're a United fan. You don't really support anyone abroad. Or oh, Coombs, though, that's a goal. That's a goal. He's fine in the back of the net, so he can score. Henry Woods. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's fair enough. But yeah, almost everyone in Australia would support a Premier League team that follows football. Most people, anyway. <laughs> and normally it's the big clubs. Glory hunters, yeah? Oh, almost! Almost. But I knew a couple people that support Everton, like, basically, because Tim Cahill played there. But they still do to this day, so that's a good thing. They didn't dip. <laughs> that's all right. You support Charlton, but we'll actually go Welling if we're away and not going. Yeah, that's fair enough. I'll go Coombs again. Coombs. <laughs> that might be something you're familiar from seeing. Oh, you're familiar seeing from him. There we go. <laughs> you talked about missing chances. There you go. There you go. What do you think about Rooney? Because he's clearly a standout. That's Adam Coombe. <laughs> oh, mate. You'll be like, this is real life. D what was that? You're like, this is real life. <laughs> he's wasting all these opportunities. Rooney doesn't get in the team. What is going on? Oh, he's left. There you go. Oh, I've got one to talk about with you. I've got one to talk about with you. Another one who's left, apparently, because uh, I had a search about him. Uh, yeah, Jay. Jay Rich, uh, the Australian. I believe he moved to Crystal Palace. So hopefully he's a... Did he... Yeah, how did he... How did he go? If you managed to see much of him. Because, yeah, I think he made a move to Crystal Palace. Excited to see how he progresses. It's a good move, you know. A young Australian player, so... Yeah, tabs will be kept on him. He wasn't with... Ah, uh, okay. I wondered if it was a case like that. If he wasn't there for long, then he, yeah, moved up. Yeah, Gold Coast boy. From the Gold Coast. Yeah, he's a unit. Yeah, he, he looks like that. Uh, from Because, yeah, <laughs> admittedly, I'd never really heard of him before. And then saw him come along. Ooh, Dean Cox. His name looks familiar. He was playing at a at a higher level. Yeah, he was Brighton, Leighton Orient, League One. Yeah, I remember his name. Like when he, did he have a little bit of potential in early FM games way back then? I don't know. He stood out to me <laughs> right there anyway. Here's Rooney. Yeah, solid like FM ten. Yeah, because I, I was playing way back then as well. I got introduced around FM07, FM08. Oh, here's Henry. Oh, he knows how to bang them in. He knows how to bang them in. He should be teaching Coombs. That's what you do. Hit it with accuracy and power. That's it. Just bang it at the goals with power. Good interception. 
Good, good. Look at that pressure. Henry, excellent. Cosgrove. Ooh, Co wait. He was in the. He's a young player, yeah. Because I, I saw him in the development center. Wait, Cosgrave. Is it Cosgrave? Aaron Cosgrave. He, you know, I, I don't like how he looks. Admittedly, like attribute wise, <laughs> like I don't like that stamina. Technically, hasn't got enough about him. Cosgrove, yeah, no, that's all right. <laughs> that's how you, that's what you call him. But I, I can see how in real life he would be a dangerous winger. I can see, yeah, how in real life for the yeah your matches he would be, you know, he would have a bit of pace. Yeah, that first touch and dribbling. Yeah, he would be your danger man, wouldn't he? I can sense that off his attributes. Oh, he plays off top though. But yeah, can see off his attributes. He's, he would have some pace and yeah, good with the ball, dangerous, run at the defense. <laughs> I can just, yeah, get that off his attribute. Even though I, I think I need his attributes to be a bit harder, higher, <laughs> harder, a bit higher to start him. But yeah. No, that's cool. It's it's cool to know some extra information about these teams or the team I'm managing. Here we go. So a 2-0 lead is, is comfortable enough, but not if we concede. Oh, Wilkes. How's Wilkes in goal? For me, for the most part, he's been pretty consistent. So far. So far. So... Let's take a look. Henry Woods, sub, Connor Diamond to come on. We don't always make that. Yeah, I'll make him go the defend duty, just a bit extra. Yeah, Dominic Vos. Last few games, he hasn't done a lot. He's been a little disappointing. Let's bring on Agumang. And on the support. Uh, yeah, we'll leave, we'll leave that. We'll leave one more sub to come up. And come in. Cook has been booked. <laughs> Cook has been booked. Oh, wait. They've got another familiar name. Was that Sergio Torres? He was definitely up higher at some point. Uh-oh. Got to be careful. Gave him a lot of time. Nah, it wasn't liking that. Michael West. Michael West with the finish. Yeah, don't like that. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Sergio Torres. Where was he? Is that... Did I know him, Peter? Yeah, I think I did a save with Peterborough. What, around that... Yeah, around that time there. Is it in the championship? There you go. One more... One more... Su Cook. Admittedly, Cook hasn't done too much. So the change we do when we take Cook off, we bring... Yeah, Critchlow Noble... And then put Green there. Green, I, I do like Green's versatility. Can play left back and left mid. His best is defensive winger though. So put him on that. Uh, here we're gonna go. We're gonna go. Yeah, positive. We'll go shorter with a lower tempo. Be more disciplined. Work ball into box. Let's go. Let's try and hold on to this. So show some passion. Can't let him creep back into. Admittedly, it's been a very, a very tight game. So can we play this out? Can we hold on to our lead? Ah, oh, we do, we do. 2-1. 2-1, that's nice. Coombs gets the player of the match. So in this save, yeah, he's, he's been alright up top. For me, he's been alright. So there we are. Adam Coombs with the one goal. Have to praise him. Well, you don't have to. We will, though. See what? He's got four goals. Yeah, that's what I mean. In the preseason, he was lighting things up with six goals in only two starts, mind you. Uh, five off the bench. Like, attribute-wise, he's a very good non-league striker in this division. So, yeah, that's seven days until St. Albans. 
a wet holder. What are they again? 19th. I reckon we can... Yeah, we can do another attacking movement, focus on our attack, and look to score some goals against them. Uh, Woods, yellow card. That's all right. No worries. You'll, you'll get your suspensions. Every so often. Josh Milton gets an injury. Yeah, I just leave to a physio. Oh, here we go. FA Cup. Yeah, second qualifying round draw. We'll go view the draw. 160 teams, just draw all and see who we get. Plymouth Parkway. I feel like we should beat them. They've got no players. <laughs> there you go. Oh, good. But guys, uh, we're going to round up this stream after this, after we play this next game. Uh, I should try and get some sleep. I shouldn't do an all-nighter. I mean, I can feel myself getting tired anyway. So, yeah, I thought I would do a, a late-night stream for myself, though. I do upload these replays on YouTube. If you go check the videos. If you wanted to relive any moments, or if you're just coming across and... You want to see or if you miss future streams and you want to catch up yeah but we'll get into this game and hopefully finish things off strongly and maintain maintain in that first position i have got a also on youtube i've got a blackburn rovers save that i'm playing we're currently in the premier league and doing pretty well so yeah a lot of a lot of fm content at the moment a lot of fm content I've been... I really enjoyed the game this year. Oh, I've been enjoying this uh, the game this year. I've, I haven't found myself getting bored of it. I've always found myself, yeah, keep continuing with the save and... Or, you know, if I finish the save, move on to another one. But I've wanted to, yeah, keep on playing, you know. It's been a good year. Do you think you play this save tomorrow? Yeah, I, I think so. Uh, it all depends what time and... How I sleep and all that good stuff. I might, I might need to record a video tomorrow as well. Probably one of the FIFA ones. I like to freshen it up. So, yeah. It could be one of those afternoon ones for me. So, maybe morning for you guys. Probably not around this time. This time is probably not going to be consistent. <laughs> considering this is like past 2am in the morning. So, let's bring on Diamond here. Play a similar role. Uh, who's going to make the bench? It's going to be a tough one here. McCallum. For left mid. So there we go. Yeah, make sure you follow me on Twitter as well. Shout out Nightbot. Uh, I always post out when I'm going live. But look at this. Johnson and Rooney have a very good connection. So right back and right mid. And then both are strikers. So we're not going to waste any further time. Let's just get right into it. Haven't watched a FIFA one. Like, honestly... FIFA is a... Like, I'm waiting for the new game. Seriously. Like... That's why I'm, like, on PC. Like, I'm using all these mods and stuff. Like, it, it's very tough to play. It, FIFA, I don't know, man. It's it's a tough subject to talk about. Because, you know, on my channel, my FIFA videos, like, I feel like I have more a FIFA audience than Football Manager, which is kind of awkward. Because <laughs> when I, I started my channel for Football Manager, shock. Um, <laughs> and, like, I did FIFA. Like, I started to upload some FIFA, and then it, it, like, it suddenly just grew my channel more. So it's always been a bit of an awkward thing. Oh, Swain! Oh, that's going to go down as a disallowed goal. So, well, I was going to say offside, but then it said disallowed, so, yeah. You know. What can we say? 
But no, nah, I can't complain because as I said earlier, FIFA always does the best for me. Like when the game drops, my Man United series, it does incredibly well. This year, the first episode got over 500,000 views. So I'm not going to say, oh, I hate this game. But like, you got to criticize it. Like I've, I'm not, I'm not sure everyone does that. I do in my videos if you watch them. And then people are like, you're just complaining because you're shit at FIFA. <laughs> and you're spelt incorrectly in the comments, of course. <laughs> you're, like Y-O-U-R. But anyway. Uh, yeah, love-hate relationship with FIFA. I played it since I was like, like eight or nine years old. Like the FIFA franchise. So what can we say? What can we say about FIFA? But here's Wilkes. We go long. Oh, it's green. Oh, right idea, but yeah, not executed. Not executed the way we plan. Shulton, oh no, uh, a game where I thought, ooh, this should be a nice one for us, we go ahead and concede, yeah, that like, when Ultimate Team was introduced, it was slowly the death of career mode, like, I think Ultimate Team, I believe, was FIFA 09 in January or February, I remember when it dropped, I remember when it dropped, and I, see, I, see, that's the thing as well, like, People see me as a career mode FIFA player. Oh my God, how many offside goals? But like, I played Ultimate Team in the first... Oh, I loved it around probably FIFA 10, FIFA 11 was at its highest. FIFA 12? Mm. Even FIFA 13. Like, I have some videos on my channel, Ultimate Team stuff, uh, in the first yeah couple years of my channel. Like, like, probably from FIFA 16 plus, it got a bit... Yeah, just got a bit too much on the money side. So, what can I say? What can you say about it? It actually used to be very, very good. And now, I don't know. Like, if anything, they have more features in it at the moment. Like, they keep adding to it. But it's just like... Yeah, I don't know, man. It's tough to say. But hey, guys, they announced Ultimate Team features before Career Mode. Like, they announced some initial Career Mode ones before, but they have their information. They got their pitch notes. They're going to... Could it be big? Could it be big? You could... We never get our hopes up, of course, but... You... you... We, we don't get our hopes up. We're like, yeah, we say that. We're like, oh, we know. We're always disappointed. But deep down, we always hope that they're going to have a big revamp of career mode. I, I can't see a revamp have it happening. Not a complete revamp. Anyway, come on, show a bit of a desire. we got to keep our, you know, unbeaten streak. We can't, we can't take an L. We can't take an L to finish the stream. That's not what we want to do here. We want to get a victory. At, 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 you know, at an absolute minimum, avoided defeat. Coombs has been poor today. Does he come... But uh, it's tough when I really rate him, his attributes. Uh, Connor Diamond off. Let's go... Let's go Agaman. Let's get creative. We've got two creative center mids now. Vos, actually, we'll go on attack. It's like having Ferrari, but shitty engine. A lot of things, but not much in sight. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. It's basically like that. And even competitive gaming, like the esports and all that, that being an ultimate team is stupid. It should be like the older days, when it was just like head-to-head. -head. Not people with players that are almost maxed out players in the game. It's not skill. Like, you can take a shot and score with someone with 99 finishing. Should that be in deciding who's the best player in FIFA? Taking shots pl with players with the highest attribute in the game? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, Swain went close. You can always play another game. That's it. But I feel like... No, the problem is... We, we used to love career mode so much. It used to be amazing. 
So we have that emotional connection to it, in a way. And you want to relive that. You want to relive from when you were younger. And that's me. That's me, anyway. Come on, though. Come on! No! That was Swain again! We're going so close. I guess we can't be unbeaten forever. We can't be unbeaten. But, like... I feel in these last couple games, it's getting increasingly harder. Okay, here we go, here we go. Come on, another highlight. I have not touched career mode since FIFA 14, man. So do you play ultimate team? Oh, Coombs. Coombs, you got to score! Mate, mate, Co you're off now, regardless of how good you are. You're off. 7.3 rating. Let's bring on Goldberg, the owner's son. The owner's son, Critchlow Noble, to left back. There's Grant Cook. I'm not... He's one of the better players, apparently. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it right now. And Green's going to go... I'm going to go winger support. Actually, left wing. He's got a wide target. Wide target, man. I'm not sure about that. Just go winger attack. Like, we need a goal. Critchlow Noble, fullback. I'm going to go a bit of a supporting role. Got to try. Got to try something. Um, what else, What else are we gonna try? Uh, what are we doing, man? Yeah, long kicks. Hey, let's try distribute quickly and over defense now. We're getting close to being desperate. Wait, can Rooney? Rooney attacking mids. Nah, we don't really have the setup for that. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. We might, we might take an L. This will be disappointing. This will be disappointing to see. Oh, out of possession. Yeah, man. We'll go direct as we can. Shoot on sight. Get that. It might be... Yeah, we might be taking our first L, which is disappointing. It's disappointing unless there's some late action. Are we going to get some late action, guys? Oh, it might be. Green. Green. Oh, my God. He passes to the keeper. He passed that one to the keeper. That is... That's not what we wanted. But the highlight is still alive. Is it going to be for us, though? Come on. you got to win this. Win the header. Rooney, come on. Come on, Rooney. Ah, no. Nah. Might be for them. Unless we win a header. We do... Who knows where this is going? Come on. Rooney, hey, you mate! Oh my gosh, Montel, Montel, you beautiful boy, you beautiful boy, beautiful strike, Montel. Guys, did you think we were just gonna waste the strike there and blast it? Uh, well, he did blast it into the back of the net, into the back of the net. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. And I'm gonna say, show some passion. I like to say that after an equaliser, when we still need a goal, when you need a winner. But yeah, we're gonna t to keep our unbeaten streak. Yeah, man. Whoo, Montel saved us there. Montel, let's say, yeah, come back and salvage a draw. The the spirit in that Montel, he deserves the player of the match with that late goal, man, for sure. Uh, we did well enough to avoid defeat, even though we should have beaten them. Hey, that keeps us. We get a point, and we're still three points clear at the top. So, that, that's not too bad. That's solid. That's solid. So, we're going to round things up. Oh, we're just going to... Yep. Monta... Oh. I don't... FM, please fix your things. A player that got an equal... You got an equalizer. I can't wait to see it. Oh, what the hell? This What a way to end it, yeah? Some dumb shit. Seriously. He got the equalizing goal and I praised him. Love your stuff, football manager. I'm going to end it here for the video. Because, uh, yeah, as I said, I upload these to YouTube. So I'm going to end the episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, great end, most definitely. <laughs> See you next time.